What is good, everybody? I am back here with Jordan. Hey. Austin. Gone. After a very long night. Jordan's been up for like how long? 28 hours now. 28 hours working. Me and Austin were up till like 2 a.m. Kind of, kind of a little partying. Austin, how are you feeling this this morning? Oh, I'm good. <laughs> we traveled to Paint Creek. It's like an hour and a half away from us. Got up at 8 a.m. to start this round. So, just try to get some uh, good shots for you guys. Okay. Really? Yeah. Not perfect. You didn't push that very far at all. I could be wrong. Dude, I'm I'm cranking on mine then. It's you, Max. Because that didn't... Unless I'm missing something big, that did not look very good. Horn's playing in the weeds there. Routine pitch up for Max. Well, while we're waiting here, I might as well show you my two new discs I just bagged. Just bought a Paul Uliberry Raptor. I needed like an overstable fairway because I left my last Raptor in this field when I was uh, practicing. Completely forgot about it and it never turned back up. And then a brand new Paige Pierce Nuke with a super swirly like outer ring here. I think this thing is pretty sweet. I think it flies a little bit more neutral. My other Page Pierce uh, nuke is very overstable. So I kinda I wanna try another one out, see if it see if it's a little bit more neutral. Three, you gotta go up around this corner. It hooks to the left. That's gonna be good. That's gonna be really good. Austin looks like he's going big skip shot. GG Wraith in his hand. Get working. Wish it didn't. There it is. Good putt, Austin. Making the birdie look easy. Ladies and gentlemen, he is four for four. He is starting off with a hot round. Over the bush. And then. Oh, baby! Good putt. Hole six, right? <laughs> yep. Hole six, 356 feet, super low ceiling. Jordan, you going high on this? You are going low? I'm going for the skip play. Okay. Push down on the right side. Austin's pretty proud of his new roller cart, by the way. a little wider though. You saw the gap in there, right? Oh, right. Let's get re redirection. Yes. Them bees are all over the place. No one has the patience for bees right now. No. <laughs> it's gonna be cut off too, isn't it? Yeah. Austin super cut off basket right there thinking about some sort of oh now it's an air shot yeah, 
Hopefully he's got a putt at least. Oh my. Great putt. Saves par from there. What's your initial thoughts of this course? We're on hole eight now. It's very well taken care of for a state park. I mean, they even flowers, pumpkins. Yeah. Everything's mowed. Fairways are clean. I think a big part of that is because obviously it is a campsite. Jordan, you liking the course? Yeah, it's a good course. Easy par fours out here. Yeah, I don't agree with all the pars. Yeah, but I'll give you that one. Yeah, the pars are a little off. Other than that, but for families coming to families coming to stay here, I can understand why they're what they are. Yeah. Check this hole out. Holy cow! 286 feet. Straight path. It's like, I don't even know if you could say this, I guess a little hyzer and straight ahead path. I don't know. It looks like there's a hyzer there. Yeah. I'm not taking the hyzer. You have to push it far. Miss it. Oh my. Do it. Keek. <laughs> Great shot. How did shot. it still hold the right line after I don't hitting know. it? I'm for sure it was going to finish left hard. Let's go, boys. I'm not going to lie. This tree was right in my way, but you you can hear it. Good ch good putt. That was clean. Nice putt. Gordon with the bird. Just landed right here. Down that crazy fairway. We're getting in some serious into some serious holes now. Super tight gap. Goes right. 226 feet. Par 3. I'm gonna give Mr. Yuli another try here. Uh, hey, just remember that's kind of beefy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> wow, he missed that tree barely. That sounded good. Oh my gosh. Great shot. This one's like really downhill scramble land. You can see the yellow band dead center of the screen. But I'm telling you, this seems like just such a scramble shot. This seems kind of ridiculous. All these guardian trees here. T-pad is where Jordan is at right now. Hit something. Well, you know you're gonna hit something on this hole. Yeah. It's just how far can you make it? How lucky can you get? This one's raking the leaves right now. <laughs> uh, 178 feet uphill, but it's dead straight. What are you going with here, Jordan? Uh, Buzz? Who knows what Austin's gonna throw? Probably a Mako. Probably. Nice <laughs> dog. Jordan's happening in his birdie. Austin for par. There we go. Austin, how's the woods versus like the open shots? Got a lot more difficult back here. Yeah, shorter holes. I feel, well, are they much shorter than out there? You got 350, 400 out in the open, but back here, they're, I haven't seen one past 300 besides that one we just played. Yeah, but uh, I mean, luckily those... that one was like a par four, so you could like pitch, pitch sort of deal. Yeah, and the other holes were hit a line or yeah, or a fight for a par. Yep. <laughs> Hole 17, par 3, 229 feet. Off to the right, actually. Let me see right there. Oh, I my do, new do. nuke out? I don't care. It's 220 feet. I know, but I think... Well, actually... I do want to throw that, but I'll just go inside. I love playing in these pines like this. Yeah, it is cool. They're always hard shots, though. Well, there's a lot of trees. <laughs> that looked parked. That's good. <laughs> Stopped him. 
Little luck never hurt anybody. Go in. Ooh. Oh, baby. Austin wasn't lying. Newly, you did it again, buddy. You did it again. Oh, I thought you threw your nuke. I decided against it. Another just insane hole. It's right here. It's kind of hard to see in the camera, not gonna lie. I guess you just want to throw like a straight something that finished left though. Oh, huge that's gap. change right there. He can find a hole 300 and what is this? 316 feet away yeah. with the sun blended in the woods, but he'll be standing on top of his disc. He's like, can't find it. <laughs> <laughs> and then when I'm looking for someone else's disc, it's just like, there's one yeah. right there. We were playing one, <laughs> we were playing Carol, and we're literally walking down the path, and he's just like, there's a disc. <laughs> I look and he picks up a freaking Yule bar, a raptor. Yeah. A I, raptor. <laughs> I did. I don't know how. I, out of the corner of my eye, I just saw a blue disc and I'm like, disc. <laughs> He's like, what do you got? Sensors in your head? It's just like. <laughs> it's crazy. He said it's crazy. I was looking so this dude good, man. is the only guy who didn't drink last night. <laughs> That's probably why he's playing so good. Well, you know, who knows? Man. Man. There's a good shot, though. Need a little height on it. You going putter? No. <laughs> Come on, match me. No. I suck so bad. Match me. I gotta to beat you. No. So you're gonna turn over too, huh? Comet, though. Did you just tell me I was a madman? Oh, that was just because of this choice. Yeah. I was lying. Oh. Is it turning? Yeah! No, that's no. what we needed. It was turning. Austin with an opportunity to save Birdie, I think. I think this is a par four again. And he does it. Great putt, Austin. In a serious battle with Jordan right now, aren't you? Well, we know we're not catching you at this point unless you really fall apart. Well, I could Emerson Keith it and, you know, plus 14. Yeah. Thanks. <laughs> Go for it. By the way, I love Emerson Keith. He got a 14 on a hole, and that's, that's just rough. Oh, man, that felt good, too. That was perfect. Yeah, I I was waiting for change. <laughs> that, that's really good. You know, I really was craving Chick-fil-A. But it's Sunday. Oh, I know that now. I was I back had... there and I was like, man, let's get Chick-fil-A on the way home. It sounds so good. And I, was like, oh, <laughs> I had Chick-fil-A yesterday <laughs> when it wasn't Sunday. <laughs> it's nowhere near you. I know, but it's mental. Oh, that is like the cheapest little roll it back. <laughs> He's like, nah, I'm gonna sit on it. Who sits on a cart like this? <laughs> like, like a little kid. I wanna watch the shot. Jawbreaker zone. Uh oh, the door is wide open. Is this the tie, Jordan? Or. Oh, so this is the go up one? It's the go up one, but he isn't making it. The fault. Bango. Hole 21, 375 foot par 3. We don't know where the hole is, but we're just throwing to throw. <laughs> oh my God, he left me and that, Austin is currently down 2, right? Yeah. yeah. To Jordan. Austin needs a big tee shot here. Lays a massive roller down, maybe? Oh. Jumped a weird. I don't know if that's pushing far enough. That might be good. And Austin, can Austin end us off on a good note? Long putt. A little high. 
and rolled a long way. Maybe it just runs in the family, obviously. What? Slamming doors. <laughs> <laughs> Jordan just got mad at me for slamming his door. You still record? Yeah. <laughs> Anyway, guys, that's going to do it for this video. I ended up minus seven, Jordan minus two, I think. Yep. Minus two. No, and minus one. Oh, Jordan minus one, Austin plus two. Yep. The guys that, uh, well, definitely Austin. He had probably the roughest night. Jordan just worked all night, I think. Oh, and, yeah, being up 28 hours. That's nothing. Oh, that's true. He's been up 28 hours because he works overnight. Is that right? I don't know why you didn't take a nap yesterday before and, work. Well, oh, I have a ah, butthole of a dog that woke me up at 5.30 a.m. on Saturday. He's blaming his dog for keeping him up. Uh, I don't know about all this. Anyway, guys, that's going to do it for this video. Make sure you hit that like and subscribe button. Go follow Chase and Chains underscore on Instagram, and uh, we'll see you on the next one.